What is going on guys? In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you an incredible spacing concept that you can use out of the U-trips that is absolutely going to torch any coverage in the game and especially some of the meta defenses that you may have faced up to this point. What's going on guys? My name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is focusing in on helping people become the best Madden players they can possibly become. And so if you're looking to get better at this game, I just want to encourage you right now to hit the subscribe button down below. It's completely free to subscribe to the channel and it just allows you to stay up to date with the latest tips and strategies right here on the YouTube channel. And like I said in this video, I'm going to be breaking down one of my favorite little spacing concepts out of the U-Trips formation. And we're going to be going over the place Scat uh, out of New England Patriots U-Trips uh, or Y-Off Trips Pats. And this is a formation that's been made famous by the pro player Decroft. Decroft is one of my favorite personal play players uh, to study film on. I think he's got one of the best Madden minds in the community. And so if you've not already followed him on Twitch, be sure to do that. Check him out in the MCS. He's one of the best players in the game. But his U-Trips offense, um, he's kind of made this offense famous. And honestly, this is one of my favorite offenses to run uh, in this year's game. And so really simple setup. All we're going to do, um, this is basically, again, it's just simply, it's simply put as a spacing concept. So I like to have backfield mismatch or master or hot route master so that I can put the running back on that side onto a table route. We're then going to streak the X receiver and we're going to put the circle receiver on a simple curl route. And really quickly before we go into this, I did want to let you know that if you're not already um, subscribed to me on YouTube, I would encourage you to do that. We stream every single day. And I also wanted to let you know about um, my text message membership. What that is, is it's a way that I can release exclusive tips and ebooks to just my text message members completely for free. So if you want to get access to that exclusive content, I break down new offenses and new defenses every single week in that text message membership. All you have to do to do uh, sign up for that is just text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. All right, guys, so we're going to motion over the circle receiver. Now you're going to see the play art change back to what we have it. And we're just going to snap him kind of right outside the numbers. And what you're going to see here is this corner route is ridiculously good against zone coverage in this year's game. This corner route is kind of similar, honestly, to a corner route that I was using out of the, I think it was the trips tight end, um, or not, or trips tight end offset. But this concept is really good. Basically, what we're doing is we're isolating that corner route being the most outside receiver. And then all you're going to see here is these curl routes. And then potentially, if you want to leave that wheel route on, you can. I personally like to take that wheel route off. But as you can see, that, that corner route is really, really good. Now, uh, and that's that's how we're going to be able to beat the cover three. And really quickly, I just want to let you know that your the cover three you're seeing is cloud flat coverage. So I've got cloud flat coverage. I've got really good, um, you know, really good vertical hook coverage on the uh, trip side, and then I've also got my user over the middle of the field. So just so you can see, I've kind of got all my bases covered in terms of a good coverage shell. But what you're going to see is in this year's game, the corner routes are just so hard to stop, um, especially when you use this little trick. Look how much separation he gets over the top for an easy, you know, 15 to 30 yards uh, against that cover three. Now, the cool part about this is this is going to work really regardless of the coverage that you're going to face. I'm going to shift over here to the cover four. Um, the cover four, maybe if I can find it here. I guess I don't have the cover four, huh? Um, I'm going to shift over to the cover four quarters. Um, and I just want to show you this. Now, cover four quarters should do a little bit better of a job uh, on this specific play because cover four quarters is kind of designed to stop these outside corner routes. So I just want you to check this out. But take a look, when we isolate him, it's basically one-on-one -on -one in man coverage. And that's gonna allow Godwin to get a really good opportunity to you know, really be putting himself in a good position to be able to beat that coverage. Now against man-to-man -man coverage, I want you to notice that this is a sharper corner route. In my personal opinion, in this year's Madden, you're gonna wanna have these sharper corner routes because the deeper ones aren't as good against man-to-man. Uh, -man. But as you see there, easy separation against man, and I'm rocking for you know a good 15 to 30 yards, maybe even a little bit more than that. As far as, um, as, far as um, the rest of the routes on this play, uh, the first route I wanna show you is this double flat uh, concept. And basically what this is, is again, all we're doing is we're just using a curl and then we're using this little button hook route. I love this these routes 
They put the defender in a ton of conflict, and as you're going to see right here, you're just going to pick one of the check down curls. So whichever one uh, looks like the best route, that's the route that you're going to take. So as you see here, I just want you to look at my coverage. I've got really good coverage. I'm dropping nine people in coverage. I've got hard flats. I've got vertical hooks. I've also got a uh, cloud flat on both sides as well. So we've got pretty much the three big best zones um, in the game. And I want you to watch how this is going to play out. You're going to see that one, if not both of those curls are going to get wide open against that coverage. That motion over curl is really kind of my bailout route. It's the route that I go to. Um, it's really good against man. It's also really good against zone. There's another setup for scat where you see that we can turn this into a post. I'm not going to do that in this video. I want to save that for a future video. But again, we're just going to motion over uh, Evans. And I haven't talked too much about the table route in this video, um, but the table route is really good for this as well. But I just want to show you these curls. What you're going to see is that circle receiver motioned over curls this year are really, 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 really good. I can't stress to you how good uh, these motion curls are. And then of course you've got your little scat um, little curl. That scat curl this year um, is really good against most people because most people in this game, what you're gonna see is they're gonna try to basically do something essentially like this, and then they're gonna sit over here in the middle field with their user. The problem is if you give them something to use or like a tight end streak, or something like that that's gonna pull their attention up to the middle of the field, then that's gonna allow a lot of spacing now for you to be able to just simply check up and hit that little scat route. And that route is so, so good against zone coverage. I wanna show you that scat route really quickly um, against man to man. I also wanna show you um, this tight end uh, streak. The tight end streak this year, I think is gonna be one of the best routes in the game. But anyways, let's just take a look at this route to square. You're gonna see he's just gonna basically low ball and you've got an easy read against man coverage and zone. So really good route, um, something that's gonna be very effective against man and also something that's gonna be very effective against zone. Now this tight end uh, streak route, I just want you to bear with me, but trust this route. This route is basically, he's always gonna get these uh, that position. If he ever gets inside position, you can always snap throw that to the tight end if that's a possibility, depending on the coverage that you get. And then last but not least, I just wanna cover um, a quick way that you can relieve yourself of pressure. If you ever get blitzed out of this formation, my favorite route in the game against the blitz is the table route. Um, the reason why is because you're gonna see here, it just gets easy separation on the sideline. And it's gonna get you a couple yards, just real simple check down, uh, check down read. So anyways, guys, that is the, um, the, the play scat with the corner route to the right side. Um, this is one of my favorite little passing concepts. As you can see, this corner route just beats pretty much every coverage. You can do a little spin move and spin it back inside. And as you can see, it's one of the best uh, coverage routes in the game. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you want to get the free schemes that I release every single week to my text message members and only to my text message members, all you have to do is sign up for that text message membership by texting the word Madden to 208 218-6900. Again, text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. Thanks for watching, and we'll be seeing you guys on our live stream later this evening.